hi guys, it's Inamka4 here with the Samsung Galaxy S4 Active. Now we all know how easy it is to take a screenshot with your Samsung Galaxy S smartphone. You simply hold down the power button and the home button for a couple of seconds until it makes a shutter sound, symbolizing that it's taken a screenshot and saved it to your gallery, like so. How easy was that? And obviously the second method is by swiping your palm across the face of the screen of the phone and whatever you have at that particular point on the screen, it'll take a screenshot of. But in order to set that up, you need to go to menu, settings, then my device, scroll all the way down to the bottom, you'll come to a section which says motions and gestures, tap on that and then go through to palm motion and just make sure you set that slider to green towards the right hand side and capture screen is also set to green. Once that's done, Obviously have whatever you want on the screen to take a screenshot of, could be a web page, could be an application, in-game footage, whatever, and then just simply swipe the screen and as you saw there, it makes a shutter down and saves it to your gallery. But does this work underwater? Here we have a bowl full of water here, so what we're going to do is bring in the Galaxy S4 Active, put it underneath the water and see if we can take a screenshot. Now obviously the screen becomes unresponsive under the water so we can't do the palm swipe but certainly we'll see if we can use the power and the home buttons to take a screenshot of this cut the rope application screen that I've got here. So we'll dip that under water as you can see the application screen is still there fully submerged under water and what we'll do is press the home and the power button at the same time see if we can hear it actually. Don't know if you actually heard that so We'll get that out of the water here and see if we can go back. We'll come out of this screen here and what we'll do, we'll go to the application screen, go to my media folder and the gallery. From here I'll go to the screenshots folder and if I load up this image here, whoops, get rid of that message there. This is the first screenshot that we've taken with the power button and the home button simultaneously. If I swipe that across, this is the application screen that we had taken with the palm swipe and here we go. This is the cut the rope application screen that we've taken underwater by pressing the power button and the home button simultaneously. As easy as that. As ever, any comments or questions you guys have got, hit them up in the comment section down below there. Give us a thumbs up if you like this video and a lot what you saw. If you haven't already done so, hit subscribe. It's also down there as well. Doesn't cost you a penny. And you can also check out some of our forthcoming videos. Thanks for watching. Have a wicked day. And we'll see you next time.